Hey, you guys. Okay, let me just say this right now. It's going to be difficult for me to keep looking at this camera because I'm using my phone and, like, I just keep looking at myself. So, hey. First of all, I know y'all see this annoying lock. What are you doing? This lock is so... I got to look at the camera right now. Just right now. But this lock is so irritating. I guess it's, like, the way it's... It's laid down. I don't know, but it won't. Like, I had to body pin it down earlier today because it was so irritating. But anyways, welcome back, you guys. So, I made this whole video telling you guys about um, my night last week at the Janae Aiko concert because it was just it was just a lot. I just almost choked on my spit. Anyways, so yeah, it was a lot. Um... But I didn't even post the video because it was just like, it was too much negativity within the video. And it wasn't her. Trust me, it wasn't her. But yeah, no, the crowd blew me. And it was just like too many negative vibes around me. Too many, too many. So I was like, let me tell y'all about this. But then after I watched the video, I was like, this is just too negative for my channel. Like, I am not endorsing negativity. So yeah, that ain't go up. But anywho, guys, guess what? I went five weeks and two days without a retweet. <laughs> Y'all know that's a long time for me. I've been trying to go as long as I can. I, the only reason why I got a retweet this this week was because I had two like professional engagements that had to be at this week. So I was like, yeah, let me do something with my hair, even though this is still doing that. But um. So yeah, I didn't retwist it myself. That's why it's so tight. <laughs> but um, I let my best friend retwist my hair. And she did it two days ago on Sunday. And it hurts because it's just tighter than I, you know, that I usually do it. But I needed it to get me through and last for a little bit. So shout out to her. Thank you, girl. Um, I'm going to show you guys up close what it looks like, of course. Um, but let me tell you. Five, oh no, wait, you know, on the 4th of December, which is like, well, that's next week, I will be five months. Oh, you guys, I'm gonna be five months in my locks, and I still have loose strands, and they're still frizzy, um, which is cool because I honestly didn't think they were gonna be this locked. Like, or that's a skinny one, you can't really tell, but. Um, I didn't think they were going to look like this. I don't know if you can tell. I don't know if y'all see them little baby hairs. <laughs> it's like, no, I need to brush them down because I look like a five head right now. But, guys, I actually, like, really have locks. Like, I have locks. Somebody told me today, they was like, that's a fresh retwist, girl. I was like, ah, they knew I had locks. Like, y'all don't know how excited I be when people know I got locks. Like, yeah, I got locks. They not little, whatever y'all thought they were. They locks. But I'm happy about that, of course. And, yeah. Uh, I'm excited. Anywho. At this point, like, my hair is, of course, transitioning. It's been transitioning for a minute. But, um... It's to the point, since I do not condition my hair, I have not conditioned my hair since, like, probably, I think, like, a little less than two months, maybe, like, a month and a half or something like that. But because I don't condition it, look at all that. That's all loose strand at the end, holding this up. Do you know how long my hair would be if I comb this out? I'm just saying. I'm not about to do it, but I'm just saying, though. Anyways. <laughs> I keep being about to choke. So, basically, since I haven't conditioned my hair in so long, my hair is transitioning over to this new excuse me to this new um i guess like texture i think that's the best way to describe it so like my texture is changing it still feels soft um like just like touching it like this and then once it grows out like and i have like unraveled hair or new growth or whatever you know come from my scalp and i like wash it and stuff it's still super soft coming out my roots. So, like, the greater hair isn't changing coming out, but, like, down the lock and around the lock, it's, like, it's starting to become, um, 
I guess a little bit more coarse because it's not being conditioned or anything. So it's not uh, as hydrated. I don't know if that's correct, <laughs> but it's not as hydrated as it used to be. Um, even though I do oil it on the regular and I try to keep it as moisturized as possible, especially because it's cold out. But yeah, the transition over from like finer hair to locks is definitely something that if you are thinking about getting locks, keep that in mind. I'm not trying to be like discouraging or anything, but just keep it real because I, like, I didn't know how to feel about it. Like I knew it was going to happen, but for some reason I just thought like, well, my hair is still going to be really soft, but it's not as soft. Like it's still soft, but it's not as soft and it doesn't really look like the same grade of hair, which is fine for me. I'm cool with it, but it may not be for you. Like, and that's just something to consider because I feel like people don't really talk about that when they think about like signs that you're like locks aren't for you or something. But yeah, I know that could be look at my soul curl. <laughs> I get so distracted. Anyways, I know that could be like discouraging for somebody because when it first started happening, I was like, I don't like this, even though I knew it was going to happen. But I'm cool with it now because now that I see that my hair is like their locks, you know, basically, um, I don't care. Like I really don't. So I'm good with that. I'm just going to show you guys my hair up close for the rest of the video. So thank you for watching as always. Happy Tuesday.